What was all the celebrating about today? Mother's Bistro began its move to a new location in downtown Portland. Cassidy Quinn is live at that new location. Kind of a sneak peek for us, Cassidy, because they're not open for business just yet. Stand by. Yes, Kathy, they actually open this coming Monday on Martin Luther King Jr. Day. We have the mother herself, of course, Lisa Schroeder. Congratulations. Thank you. So you guys just had that huge parade. I saw you. You had a hat on, a big outfit on, just rallying the crowd up. How was that? What did it that feel like? It was amazing. It was the, <laughs> one of the most joyous days of my life. Absolutely fun. And now Monday, you guys get to open this new location. So for all those people, was it? were there any sad feelings of people walking from the old location to the new one? You know, we've said some, shed some tears, but every time I go back to that old location, I think of how happy I am that there's this. How many people do you think were at the parade? I'd say we had a few hundred. That's amazing. So they marched again from the old Mother's Bistro location to this new one between Ash and Pine yes. on Southwest 3rd Avenue. We right now are standing in one of the spots that people might love the most of this new location. It's not even where you will sit to eat, but it's where you have room to actually wait for your table, right? If you have to wait. Right. <laughs> maybe the wait will go down a bit now that we have all this extra space. Yeah, but it is huge. You got I've seen you guys painting the benches in yes. here. So people have some room. And there's the whole hotel in. over there where they're mm -hmm. saying we welcome you to wait in our hotel lobby. So that's really amazing. The beautiful Embassy Suites Hotel, formerly the Multnomah Hotel. So over there, you got the bar. There's yep. the lounge in the back. But we're going to walk this way. Okay. You call this the family room. Yes. And I think this is wonderful. No biscuits in the oven right now, but this is gonna if you be ever go to Mother's, every waiter and waitress that works there tells you you have to order a biscuit, and people can watch you make them right here. Yeah, our bakery's going to be wide open, and the best part, you can smell them. That's what I can't wait for. That is the best kind of marketing. <laughs> and then if you remember the old Mother's location, there's a ton of mirrors and pictures on the wall, <laughs> so you guys get to hang these soon before yep, you open them Yeah, we're going to do night. that tomorrow. And this is a table from my house, a 14-foot Babinga table. What? It's going to seat 22 people we can have around that table. That's so cool. Yeah, people might recognize it. It does kind of look like the old exactly, Mother's Bistro location right? in here we with kept, the color scheme. We kept some elements, changed some others, brought the gold, but added some other new colors. And then you'll see the kitchen in the back. So before, we just showed you the bakery. Normally, people have never been able to see you guys actually in the kitchen. Now I've you can see us in operation. I've always been to Mother's and thought, is there a mother? Like, who is back there making all these delicious things? People can come watch you while they're eating? Yep, absolutely. They can watch us cook. Now, will the menu be the same at this new location? The menu is going to have all the same dishes we had before but we're modernizing it, taking out some extra words, oh. making it look pretty, and we're adding a lot more things at dinner. Things like yes. linguine and meatballs and pork schnitzel with spätzle oh. and grilled wild salmon. So we're gonna have a lot, oh, roast chicken's coming back on our menu. Yes. So what time do you open on Monday? 7 a.m. 7 a.m.? Kathy, you should be here. I, you know, it's my fault that we came here on the day that there's no food, but it is beautiful. I'll make it up And we gotta to let Lisa get back to work. You guys got a lot of things to I do here. I gotta put things away. <laughs>